Hi, this is Josh with Resort TV One. Today we're taking you on a relaxing stroll from Boardwalk Resort to Disney's Hollywood Studios in 4K. We hope you enjoy the video. Make sure to leave us a like and a comment and also subscribe if you haven't already done so and hit the bell to enable notifications so that you get notified every time we go live or have a new video. And this is part two of this stroll. The stroll in total goes from Epcot all the way to Hollywood Studios. And this is part two from Boardwalk to Hollywood Studios. So make sure you check out part one if you haven't seen that yet. And I won't be talking the whole time on this stroll, just point out a few things along the way. Limited narration and then just enjoy the ambiance of this beautiful area around Crescent Lake here. beach club across the lake and of course we're here at boardwalk I don't think I've ever seen both boats turn in the water like that before. That was like a boat do -si do That was pretty cool. So this isn't actually the way to Disney's Hollywood Studios, but I had to come up here and get a great view of the swan and dolphin for you. 
the path to Hollywood Studios is over here and we'll go take that path here in just a second right where those people are walking so don't get confused <laughs> somebody's probably watching and saying he's going the wrong way but yes that is the path we're gonna go over there in just a second but I really wanted to give you some great views here first All right, we're gonna head back down the hill and we will join the boardwalk to Hollywood Studios path. All right, so again, we're backtracking just a little bit. So if you don't wanna see that view there and you wanna just go straight to Hollywood Studios from boardwalk, you actually just, there's the jelly rolls and the Atlantic dance there. There's the boardwalk just beyond that. Right where those people are walking. You just turn left immediately when you pass Jelly Rolls. Not the blacktop one, but actually the sidewalk here. The blacktop one is a service vehicles road. So you want to stay off of that so that the service vehicles can get through and get their jobs done. You can just see one of the boardwalk pools there, just beyond the two buildings there. It's actually a water slide kind of themed like a roller coaster.
All right, we're back. I just took a little break there because it wasn't a lot to see between where we just stopped and the bridge, and I figured I would just cut out a little bit of the more monotonous part of the trail. It's still very peaceful, but anyway, once we go under this bridge here, which is Buena Vista Boulevard here, Buena Vista Drive, I think, sorry. Once we go under this bridge, we will be able to see the entrance to Hollywood Studios. And if you're curious, by the way, and you wanted to really time the walk, uh, I only cut out about a minute just now, so basically just add a minute to what we did here and you'll be all set. If I can do a little zoom here, you can see Galaxy's Edge. So here's the bus loading area for the theme parks from Hollywood Studios. This is where you get on the uh, Magic Kingdom bus and the next one's Epcot and so on and so forth. So I think these have moved actually since the construction. They don't normally take the buses but I think these didn't used to be here. 
correct me if I'm wrong in the comments. Now you see some of the supports for the Skyliner, which is under construction right now, a cable car system that will be uh, used for transportation here at Walt Disney World soon. And on the other side of this green barrier here is uh, one of the stations. I believe this will be the Hollywood Studios Skyliner station. You can just see it over the barrier there. And you can see it's kind of a cloudy, rainy day. It's actually sprinkling right now, but actually makes filming pretty good with the uh, sun not able to uh, wash things out as much. There's a advertisement about the uh, Skyliner. Well, we are here at Hollywood Studios, just around the corner. So we'll walk up to the entry plaza and then we'll wrap it up. Of course, we can't film through security anyway once we get up to that point but at least hopefully you have a little bit better idea of what is involved in this walk it's very doable you can tell you know I've been walking at a pretty good clip and you can tell that I'm not I'm not really that well in shape and you can tell I'm not winded so you can actually do this walk and it's really not that bad now if it's really really hot then you know just, get, just take your time and have plenty of water but if it's a nice day like today it's really not too bad You wonder what the beeping is? We got buses uh, loading uh, wheelchairs. So that's what the beeping is. It's a warning because they have a ramp that comes out and just in case somebody might be in the way, they have the warning. The warning beeper just to make sure everybody's clear. So you can see the Tower of Terror. We're coming around the corner and uh, we are here. So we hope you enjoyed this relaxing stroll all the way from Epcot to Hollywood Studios. Now, of course, on this video, we just did Boardwalk to Hollywood Studios, but uh, in the previous video, we did Epcot to Boardwalk. So make sure you check out the first video. I'll link it in the description just in case. And uh, also make sure, again, you're subscribed, hit the like button, all those good things. It really helps us out when you do that. And leave a comment and let us know what you think. We love hearing uh, your suggestions and your feedback. Also, make sure you check out our sponsor, mickeyblog.com and mickeytravels.com for the best in free Disney vacation planning advice. Also, make sure you check out windowrepairparts.us. So for now, have a great big beautiful tomorrow. Bye-bye. Now that you've finished watching this video, be sure that you're subscribed so that you can get all of the latest updates. Also, check out some other great videos on our channel. Have a great big beautiful tomorrow. Bye-bye.